Pull him oh, down. Pull him down. There you go. Pull him hard. Pull him hard. Get him out of there. There you go. Oh my goodness, Houston. There you go. There. Just fight him. Just fight him. Let him fight, buddy. What's up guys, we are back with another video. Before we get started, go down there, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and like this video. And today, we are here in Pensacola, fishing with one of our buddies. <laughs> well, Houston, you're almost right. So we're actually in Perdido Key right now, oh. but uh, we're, you, you, well here's the thing. He said we're fishing with one of our buddies, so Bama Beach Bum. We fished with Bama Beach Bum on the beach before. We're neither in Alabama or on the beach, right. so. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he invited us out to go fishing on Ron's boat here. This is cameraman Ron. What's up, guys? It's pretty much this is what you go by, right? That's YouTube it. channel cameraman Ron. Cameraman Ron, Ron yeah. Bama Beach Bum. And uh, actually, we're here with like the whole family the outlaws, the in laws, and everybody in between. I think there's like 19 people at our little beach house on the beach. And uh, we're here for a week in Pensacola, Florida. I'm going to hang out and have some fun, do some stuff. But uh, Houston and I wanted to slip away one morning and do some fishing, huh? Yeah, we're going actually going to do some shark fishing too. Not on this boat. We're going to do some beach shark fishing while we're here. So I don't know. We're going to have some fun and see what we can get into today. Mangrove. That's a mangrove snapper right there. there you go. That's, a good. That's a probably a keeper fish right there. He's close. Hammer. Yeah, a little mangrove snapper. We'll get a better one on him. You ever caught a mangrove? Yeah. Look at their teeth, man. And they will actively try to bite you too. Yeah. You put your finger, they'll try to bite your hand. Nice little mangrove snapper for Houston. We'll get a measurement on him. He might be a legal fish. Now, he is right there at legal size. So inshore on these is 10 inches. And he is right there. So we're gonna get that dude back in the water. Hey, he's over here checking my fish. <laughs> Who? I gave you the rod. What do you mean I'm taking your fish? So we're just going to start off this morning fishing these docks and piers and uh, dropping a little live bait, live shrimp down, trying to catch, uh, well, like Houston caught that mangrove snapper, trying to catch some redfish or whatever will bite a shrimp, in my opinion. Oh, yeah. Dang, we thought we had a double here. Are you going to be handing this one? I don't care, yeah. Houston, you want to catch this fish and let him get you unstuck? Sorry about the awkward reel, bro. Oh, you know. There's a fish here. Alright, we're on the same we're on the same one. Now that's a keeper mangrove right there. Yeah. There's no question on that one, buddy. Yeah, that is 100 percent That is not a creek fish. <laughs> <laughs> not even close. A little different than a creek fish, huh? They yeah. fight pretty good, don't they? Yeah. For little guys. Yeah. You might have had a fish on here. Alright, Houston, you got the first keeper fish in the boat. Actually two. First well, no, we didn't keep the first one. The first one was technically a keeper, though. We just chose not to keep it. Oh. He was close. Yeah, that one should be closer. Oh, I'm not. I mean, we can yeah. measure him if you want, but I mean, he's, this guy's 11, 12 inches. Yeah, he's a full 11. We're good. Sweet. There you go. Got another one already? What? Yeah. There. Houston's just out here putting on a clinic, guys, with these mangrove snappers. Uh, we're gonna have to change that shirt from a from a bluegill to a mangrove, Houston. <laughs> Just don't try to lip him, okay? Yeah, don't put your finger in his mouth. Whatever you do, you might come back without finger. Uh, I got him. I got him. Oh, you got him? Oh, here, oh, here, here, we got double. We got double. All right. Now like Daniel's on. Hold the camera. And my my rod took off the other direction. There, there you go. Those? We are in some mangroves now, guys. Got Daniel on one. We, we Houston, step pitch, up there with him, buddy. Got double the points now. Yeah. Nice little mangrove snappers right there for sure, guys. Hey, if those are keepers, throw them in the box. Man. Yeah, be careful, Daniel. He was real close. I got here's some pliers. He was snapping that. I was gonna say, man, you had your fingers real. Daniel just about found out why they call these things snappers. He is actively trying to bite him right now. He definitely is. And uh, we're gonna. Doubt. Yeah, we're gonna get Houston's fish off here. I don't want to do it. You don't want to do it. You don't want to get bit? They yeah. definitely snap at you. Yeah, right there. He's, he's trying to bite my hands. He does not like me doing that. So I'm, I'm pulling back up here. I don't know if it's red, but it might be a nice mangrove. I think it's a nice mangrove. 
I'm pulling. Yeah, I'm pulling back up here. Houston, I think I got your beat on this one, buddy. Oh, that's red. That's that red. is a red. It's a little rat red. Nice, man. Got your beat now, Houston. Woo. Yeah, well, I can't get still to go. Can't get your rod out there. Look at there. How long does it have to be? How big does that be? 17. 17. So yeah. nowhere near 17. No, he's not 17, so. Uh, well, a nice little redfish, nonetheless, man. Fish kiss? You can, you can kiss that one. He don't have teeth. <laughs> yeah. Give him no Richard Jean. Oh, yeah. Lay him in there sideways. I love Do you ever watch him? Oh, I love watching him. Yeah. And that is literally habit for me. <laughs> so it's like. <laughs> Daniel sucked up again. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. So, what we got, Houston? What do you think it is? No! Oh, oh, stud mangrove snapper, Daniel. Oh, look at that one. Wow. Dude. Oh, that's 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 oh the you're thing are you are you are bitten by. It was. Oh, man. Definitely going to have to have some pliers for that one. Yeah. That, I'm not reaching in there after that. Yeah. Daniel about learned a valuable lesson on the last one, <laughs> and he doesn't want to put his hand down in there. Look at this inshore mangrove, dude. Choked it. That, that's like a 13, which is a very a good. very good inshore Very good inshore mangrove. mangrove. For sure. He's trying to bite me. He will, man. Like, they actively try to bite you. Look at that. That is a good fish, man. He's, he's going to be measuring on him. That's probably going to be a 13 inch yeah, for real. Yeah, he's a full 12, man. 12 and a half. And 12 and a half? At least. Oh, yeah. Full 12 and a half. Yeah. That's a stud fish for yeah, inshore, yeah. man. Like, that's a good mangrove snapper, man. Just a creek monster, right? Yeah, right. Just a creek monster with teeth. Hey! Fishing under the dock, not on the dock, okay? Dude, hey, be still. You got fish poop on your cheek. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. It's all right there. Is that really? Yeah. It's like war paint. Go catch another one. It's a red. Here, let me, let me up there so I can fill. Sorry. Each other on the boat around the video. Hey, I will do. I'll do what I'll do. Oh, that's it. That's your oh, that's slot it, red. It, it's a slot it. red. Hey, get him a get him a net, Matt. Oh, much bigger than Houston's. For oh, sure. and Houston's doubled up too. All over the place here. That's what's oh, yeah. up. That's what we wanted right there. That's the slot. Yes, sir. That's fish. Up here, baby. Is Houston still on? What about me? Yours is in, man. It's important, but your dad's got a bigger fish. Come on, Bubba, Come on. What are you doing, Matt? <laughs> Matt just tr straight tried to sabotage your fish, bro. It was going everywhere. It's I got right. the baby one. That's okay, man. Oh, okay. Nice fish, dude. That's why we wanted to come here. Yeah, Dad, look at all those still, spots, the man. The shrimp is still on the hook. You didn't even lose your bait. I didn't even lose my bait. my fish. You could eat yours, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Look at that. Man. Look at all those spots, man. You got a, That's a lot yeah, of spots two, on a redfish, one, man. One, two, three, four, five, six. What really do you got on the other it. side? Look at shrimp. I still uh, six, wow. seven, eight, nine. You got 11, 11 spot redfish, man. That's spotter. nice. Measure him up. See what he is. Oh, guys, look to your right. Yeah. Big old bar. Watch out. Let's measure this guy. I think you just caught the red. I lost a second ago there, Daniel. Well, he didn't have a hook in his mouth. <laughs> so it looks like he's right at 20. Yeah, man. That's a keeper perfect. slot fish all day. That's perfect eating right there. Well, we're dang sure gonna put him on ice. So I can keep from losing him. I almost got a gaff in me though. So much bad stuff just about happened. <laughs> this, is, this is when fishing gets interesting. Right? There we go. Dude, look, look at Captain Ron's charter service filling That's up right. the box. Man. I don't know about all that now. I'm just going to have to ask for a refund because I saw him on video a while ago say, this is not a charter, but he asked me for my PayPal. <laughs> that was for a whole nother thing, though. It's fine. <laughs> oh, yeah, He's got a red. He's got a red. Pull him hard. There you go, buddy. Keep pulling. You're good. Keep pulling. Oh, yeah. You're good. Let him go a little bit. He's coming around that piling. Let him go. Just keep it. Now pull it. Now pull it. Pull him down. Pull him down. There you go. Pull him hard. Pull him hard. Get him out of there. There you go. Oh, my goodness, Houston. There you go, just fight him, just fight him. Let him fight, buddy. Bring him to the right. Over here. Yeah, try to, try to bring him to the right. 
Oh, gosh. Come on, Captain. Oh, what happened? That's two. You're two for two on bad net skills here. <laughs> Come on, Captain. All right, we got it. We got it. We got it. Is trying to I'm trying to sabotage you guys. <laughs> I mean, he's doing everything he can to knock one off a hook. I fished the beach. Yeah. Right yeah. Now, man. Hey. That I, is bigger. Uh, that, that's nice, bigger than yours. Dude. He's used to dragging them up on the sand in his defense. <laughs> <laughs> I seriously thought you were gonna lose that fish for really, man. Like I was freaking yeah, out. I, yeah, I, I thought hit. it was gonna get tangled. Yeah, you did a good job, dude. Hey, Let you go, brother. That's the way you horse a fish out yeah. of Houston. Good job, buddy. That was an awesome. Ride. I think that one might be bigger than yours. Uh, we're gonna find out because the board don't lie, man. Uh, we can say it is. Good job, buddy. See, easy. <laughs> it's in my hand. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> telling you, he's about that sabotage life. All right, let's measure him up, Houston. See how big yeah. yours is. Sure, buddy. step off of there. Here, let's let's just say when we um get him filleted, oh, we'll he is bigger than Daniel's is by he? an inch. Daniel's was right at twenty. His is right yeah. at twenty-one. Well, by a half inch. I mean, I didn't pinch the tail and push down and knock the air out of him. You know. <laughs> no really? joke. Really? All right, Houston. Yeah. The biggest would probably be like a shark. What about those uh, paddlefish, though? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That would be my third biggest, probably. <laughs> That's still cool, though. Yeah. Well, first redfish, man. Give me knuckles. Is that your first red? first red? Yeah. Oh, oh really? Good job, yeah, dude. Yeah, That's awesome. Brother. That's good. That good. At least I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no, I'm sure. I'm positive yeah. that's your first redfish. Yeah. You're not netting this fish. You're, you've <laughs> lost those privileges. I'm trying to get a full right here. The Beach I got one! Oh, yeah. Do you? Are y'all? I think you're hooked. I think you're caught. Yeah, that. I think you were. Hang on, that motor's hanging. Watch the back there. Watch the back. Oh, there you go. Oh, that was. I, I got that at the last second. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, you're, you're on my line, buddy. The motor died. Yeah, the trolling motor died. Here, you hold He's it off. He's off. He's off. All right. Oh, no! Dang it. Did it break off? Dang. No, it didn't break. I was trying to pull him around that pole because we were drifting backwards so fast that I lost him. Sorry. The daggone trolling motor of all the times to die. I was, he was going straight backwards the same direction as the boat, but my rod was fixing to be completely wrapped around that pole. That was another red, too, man. I know it. Uh, stupid. I knew the trolling motor died. As soon as we... Uh, I don't know. Well, they got really intense for a whole 30 seconds there. We were trying to trying to get the big red fish out from under all the under the pier and all around the pylons and all that. And Ron was running one motor and another motor, and the trolling motor died, and the boat was going backwards. And we were really just afraid that the old Bama beach bum was going to try to knock my fish off with a net. So that's we were all. Trying. I was just trying was to like trying get to the net it. so so Matt didn't have it because. The yeah. worst thing that you want is Matt to not net your fish. That's right. That's right. He's uh, struggling with the net today. And we're going to catch more fish. I know we are. But that was a good one. Houston? Yeah. Why don't you go get him for me? Um, I'll try. So is it dead completely now? No. It's just working until we need it. Yeah, it's like. <laughs> But the, the pilings are smooth, so that's the thing we've got going for us right now, guys. Yeah, there you go, Matt. There we go. Here you go, Daniel. You want to net his fish and knock it off for him? <laughs> you want to come down side? Yeah, now, now Daniel's going to get some I'd sweet. I'd be proud, too. Woo! Redemption. You need to bring him to the other side. What are you doing? Just, here you go. I got you. Come here. Oh, let's go that way. Just, just knock him straight off, Daniel. <laughs> like, so the goal is to hit the line right above the hook, right? Right. That's, oh! Oh, good job, oh, Daniel. Got him. Got him. Got him. <laughs> <Knocked him right>. <laughs> <laughs> that was it's awesome. <laughs> go, go, gadget net and knock him off, you know. I lost two. That could not have worked out any better. I'm sorry you lost your fish, Beach Bum, but that was funny. You had that coming after your botch net job, man. I, I told you. That's okay. <laughs> this is pretty red, though. Are you going to actually <laughs> land this one? Or? I don't know. Here, I'll do it. I can't. <laughs> oh, yeah. Houston wants to. Houston. What? Or no, it's red. All right, bring him around here. Houston's gonna net him for you. Houston's about to get that sweet revenge like Daniel did. 
Oh, yeah, hey, careful there. I'd get down in the boat, Houston. Yeah. Get down in the bottom of the boat. Go. He's gonna bring him to you. Maybe. Alright Houston, your goal is to knock this fish off this of the hook. Smaller, right? so. oh. Hey! Oh, I just needed Houston to be my net man there. <laughs> the best one so far! Hey, thank you buddy. Way to go. I caught a fish today. <laughs> Y'all, I promise you, he's, if y'all watch this one's video, he's gonna edit that and make it look like I didn't just hook that fish up for him, but I assure you I did. Oh. Like that. <laughs> Captain Ross, I thought we were friends. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Beach Bum got that one all on his own, y'all. Y'all want this one too? Sure. Yeah. I'm not turning down fish. Okay. That's how you you know why? He knows he's not big enough. Yeah, he's, like, <laughs> he's like, I got nothing to worry about. This guy can't keep me. I'm good. We headed back to the water, huh? Oh, oh, what's Houston got? Houston got him a, a pile? Oh, it looked like a headache. Oh, that's a fish, dude. Holy moly. Get him, Houston. Get him out oh, got no, him. He's, he's pulling him out. He's good. Oh. Oh, man. That was, that, was, that was a big red, Houston. You was about ready to put it on him, buddy. That one was uh, big enough to eat this one, probably, buddy. Yeah. yeah. You one. were on a stud right there, Houston. <laughs> I'm gonna put this guy back, he's not big enough. Yeah, man, I was sure hoping he'd get that one in. I thought he had the hole there until the drag started ripping. Yeah, that drag started flying. What'd that one feel like, buddy? <laughs> like a small shark. <laughs> he might have been bigger than you. Maybe. I mean, the big ones are about halfway. <laughs> big ones are half your size? Yeah. You want to get him? Yeah. Yeah. Big fish. Don't oh, rush. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't rush. You're going to get wrapped around that pole. Oh, yeah. He's, he's trying. That's, that's a keeper. That's a keeper. That's your other keeper, man. Y'all got the net? Go on, net guy. I'm going to net this one for you, and we'll be in good shape, I promise. You got to get him up here, though. You can't let him whoop you. Yeah, he's gonna be strong. Get him over here towards me. You know what? You know what you just did though? I think you just topped your dad on spot count for sure. I think you hooked him in the gill. Cause that's a pretty red fish, man. Check out all the spots on that dude, guys. Yeah, you definitely gonna have more spots than your dad. All right, let's get him off here if you want to hold that on. Yeah, that's it. That's the... Yeah, that's all we can keep. And I'm just saying, like, Houston ripped his entire, like, left gill plate. I mean, look, it's what? literally laying right there, like, his whole gill plate. He just put it on him, huh? Yeah. I, I did not do that. I did not. He had it. You reeled him in. I just fish. hooked him for you. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're okay with killing something. Drop it over the side. We're, we're gonna eat him either way, right? Yeah. Even if his gill gets right there. That's almost the exact same size as your first one. Really? Yeah. Filling up the fish box. Houston? Yeah. Looks like you're bringing home supper for everyone back at the house. Yep. You only got about 19 people to feed. You think you can handle that? Yeah. It's actually amazing, Houston. <laughs> there they are. <laughs> Where'd you learn that awful noise? Uh, me. <laughs> okay. They, they did their snout. Well, the fishing has slowed down. Caught quite a few fish. Houston's throwing all of our bait out so we don't get stuck doing a uh, bait. A shrimp uh, catch, clean, and cook. <laughs> well, I think we're gonna go back to Ron's house. They've been talking all morning about something about Cheetos. They like cheese Cheetos. Cheese balls, man. Cheese, cheese balls. balls. Not Cheetos. Cheese balls. Cheese balls. Ron's got this thing with cheese balls, and he says he's got a good recipe for a, a fried fish with a cheese ball. I don't know if they're on the side or on it or what, but we're gonna go back and cook some fish. Houston's getting rid of all the bait so he don't have to eat shrimp. 
and uh, we're being quite catch enough to feed 19 people. So we're gonna go back and clean some fish and at least do a little catch, clean, and cook with these guys and uh, see how Houston likes cheese mangrove balls. snapper. And cheese balls, breaded with it. This is his box today. He's got a nice, nice haul. <laughs> I can't hang on to him. I got the biggest one, right? I think so. We can say you did regardless. Yeah. I think you did. Yeah. You lost the Looks like all these Houston. were the ones that Houston caught. I caught those <laughs> those big reds. No, I caught some of them too. Oh. Houston, I didn't remember I that. He caught the biggest fish, but he lost the biggest fish yeah. too. Yeah, I got all. So I do have one question, fellas. On the way over here, Houston asked how much Bama Beach Bums cameraman makes because he said well it's this cameraman ron it's his cameraman right <laughs> well, <laughs> well brant hired him well, hired me <laughs> how's that happen I, I told him you actually have your own youtube channel you're That's not right. just bama beach bums no i'm not just i'm not just their cameraman it just so happened that the youtube channel turned into cameraman ron because i do a lot of filming but we do other stuff too so um, unfortunately, the pay is very, very low for, <laughs> for filming for Bama Beach Bomb. I Sounds like, like it's mostly harassment. I, yeah, I mean, I pretty much... Well, for me, I'm the one that gets harassed all the time. Well, yeah, until I start getting paid, you're going to. So, <laughs> that's a great I mean, question, Houston. I will say this, though. A good God takes you out, puts you on the fish, brings you home, cleans the fish. That's what we're doing. We're going to clean the fish, but I'm not a God. That was a joke number, on my channel. Number right here on the screen. <laughs> We're gonna give. Let's give him Jack Motley's phone number. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> you know, it's nice going fishing when you don't even have to come home and clean your own fish, man. I just, I really appreciate this God service business stuff. <laughs> and, uh, I think you got the idea from him on the beach, and then just, just tried to roll with it. Wait, huh? did you clean fish for your customers on the beach? I did. Oh, he did cleaned you? fish for me. Yeah, I, I took it. I always took it to my house usually. Gosh, I had him follow me. I like that you finally broke out a real knife. Yeah. I catch heck for using a fillet knife, an electric fillet knife, on my channel. Me really? too. And uh, it's good to know somebody in Florida uses electric fillet knife down here. I'm not a good judge of this because, like, I don't do a lot of things right, Daniel, so. <laughs> so, we're at Ron's house and then we're going to fry up some of this fish just to taste because Houston obviously isn't going home without eating fish, right? Mm hmm. He made us keep every fish we caught, even the ones that weren't legal. Easy. <laughs> there, was no, there was no illegal fish kept on the Mako today. I just wanted to like, throw that out of there. Okay, okay. So, uh, cheese balls. Yeah, just like breadcrumbs, only cheese balls. The trick to this, though, we did find this out on one of Beach Bones videos, is you do not want to salt your fish before you cook it, it in the cheese ball because it makes it really salty. So, no seasoning required when you're cooking with cheese balls. Cheese, cheese balls are the all-in-one fish batter. They right? are, they are 100%. Wait, is this the reason you invited me over? Because you don't know how to cook? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Houston, so what's your thoughts before we do this? Do you think? It's gonna taste like cheese balls and fish. Cheese balls and fish. All right, so we work with a dude named Ryan Lander and he taught us the double dip method. So you're gonna put it in egg and you're gonna take it. You do the same thing if you're doing it with flour and then you're gonna put it in the cheese balls. And then you can go back to the egg. And you can go back to the cheese ball again. It gives you a nice thick. Well, see, last week when we were catching frogs with Cole and Jay, Cole said you go flour, egg, flour, and that's all it took. And you his, can do that for sure. His frog legs were phenomenal, weren't they? Yes. Yeah, and I'm sure. He didn't try no fancy tricks like cheese balls. Well, I mean, just imagine how good frog legs would be cooked like in cheese balls because i do like some frog legs oh well, they were amazing yeah i do like some frog legs so i mean i can imagine if you mm -hmm. breaded them and awesome. cheese balls so you gotta let us know how it tastes the rest of us are too scared to try it <laughs> oh it's a good piece it's a different taste I don't know. I don't know what it tastes like. But do you, it doesn't matter what it tastes like. Do you like it? Yeah, I do. All right. That's, I mean, that's the important part. You don't <laughs> got to figure it out. Well, we weren't man. looking for a comparison. Yeah, man. All right, Daniel. This looks good. You're not lying to me, are you, Houston? No, I'm not. 
Now, I just what possessed you to put cheese balls on a piece of fish? The same in the thing, beginning. The same thing that possessed the first dude to put gravy on biscuits, I guess, because it's about like that. I don't know if it's gonna be that good. <laughs> Pretty good. Hmm. You like it? It's definitely not like a Cajun fish fry. No. You know, but. And the mangrove snapper's really good. Mangrove I mean, snapper's one of my favorite fish to eat. It's good. It's like a. It's a more like a uh, restaurant style batter. It's not. You know, put, doing the egg wash is obviously not going to be the same as a cornmeal type batter, but um, it's actually really good. I mean, I didn't think it was going to be bad. Don't get me. <laughs> I wasn't trying to tell you it was going to be bad, but I just wasn't sure about it. It's different, but I'm telling you, it's good. Would you eat it again, Houston? I already have. Oh, you're still eating it. Okay. <laughs> now, that's a good answer there. <laughs> yeah, that's a telltale right there. I'm still eating it. All right, guys. Well, Houston and I just made it back to our house here on the beach. We are staying right across the canal from the best place to eat on the beach in Pensacola, which is Peg Leg Pete's. If you're a, a seafood person, best place to eat. But uh, anyways, we had a great time fishing with Bama Beach Bum and Cameraman Ron. They both have YouTube channels. I'll leave links in the description box. Go check them out. Tell them Daniel and Houston from Arms Family Homestead sent you. And uh, we're just going to hang out, go to the beach probably, spend some time with family, not doing a whole lot. We just wanted to get in a quick fishing trip while we were here. And uh, those guys invited us out so we couldn't tell them no. Holy, mal holy moly, Houston, look. There goes a giant boat down the little canal. That's almost barely the canal. Yeah, that one barely fits in there, huh? All right, well, everyone else is already at the beach. So uh, let's wrap this thing up and go hang out at the beach for a while. What do you say? Yeah. You going to end this video for us? Yeah. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, we'll see you all next video. Peace.